It's very serious because especially with the economy starting to show warning signs of a recession, uh, the trade tensions exacerbate that, the tariffs exacerbate that. Um, so one of the things to, that we're all looking at is will there be a stepping back from the edge of the cliff? Um, in the past, there's been a lot of brinksmanship. There have been tariffs imposed, but before they're really catastrophic tariffs, um, the U.S. and China have worked things out so that the two sides back away from the edge of the cliff. So they have until September 1 to make that happen. The Chinese are completely reliable in retaliating. And so whenever the United States imposes tariffs, China imposes tariffs. So this wasn't an unexpected move. He really is extremely unhappy with the inability to negotiate with the Chinese to reach a big trade deal, which is what his objective has been. And so um, his warning to the Chinese is that um, he's going to make it so that U.S. companies find it difficult to engage with China. He's given a message saying he wants for U.S. companies to find other countries to do business in, that they should disentangle their um, engagement with the Chinese. The business community is really whipsawed. Um, they feel day to day that they don't know what's happening here. The landscape is changing all the time. It's really quicksand. The areas that would be most impacted um, would be certainly in the automotive industry. That's one of the areas where the Chinese are punching the hardest um, with tariffs that would be up to 25% on U.S. automobiles that go into China. There would also be tariffs on automotive parts um, the agriculture sector continues to be a focus of the Chinese. And one of the new areas that's been added to this is crude oil. Um, that one is very interesting. Um, crude oil is something that the Chinese desperately need, and they have been importing crude oil from the United States. And so the fact that they're willing to impose tariffs on products that they want very much is meant to signal the U.S. very strongly about uh, the seriousness of purpose with which they're approaching these discussions.